so your friend finally forced you to come and see me what did your friend tell you that made you change your mind it was actually because of how i did not take the card why she's my boyfriend's sister oh oh i see okay so what did she say to you that that made you come see me she only reprimanded me <laughs> You said you're building in the next village. Yes, I am building. Actually, I am building a new house for my mother. She lives three villages away from here. And I have a building, my personal building in the next village. I also have a building of my own in the city. Where is your office? I, I work from anywhere. Does that mean you carry your uh, <laughs> office on top of your head any, to anywhere you're going? <laughs> uh, no, not at all. You see, why some people have this static office? Uh, some of us has these uh, mobile offices. I see. So you're one of those people who have mobile offices. Exactly. Exactly. You're correct. Okay, but what exactly do you do? Well, I'm a blogger. Hey, those people that don't like to tell truth about people. Ah, <laughs> really now? Uh, so, are you, um, is that how you define us? Yes, now, it's true. People see red and say it's black. Mm -hmm. Then when you don't see anything at all, you start painting rainbow colors. Uh, it is not exactly that. Are you attacking our profession? <laughs> no, I'm not. So I'm not attacking you. Okay. It's your profession. No. Okay, okay. I see. Okay. It's okay. Um, well, it is what it is. Enough of me. Let me ask you. Did you go to school? Yes. I'm a graduate of civil engineering. I see like. You're a graduate? So what are you doing in this village? Well, I just want to spend time with my mother and my siblings, yes. My mother went through a lot to send me to school. Uh, you stay here, eat from her, you know, she does everything for you. Why don't you go to the city, make money and take care of the family? I know all of that. It's just that if I leave this village, I won't come back in a hurry, so... I just want to stay with my parents, my siblings, you know, just let them enjoy it while it lasts. Mm, okay, sound convincing. Mm, let me ask you another question. Do you, do you like Lotto? Gambling? Ha! Honestly, I don't like gambling. No. Lotto is not gambling. You, you stand to lose nothing. As a matter of fact, the least you can do is to win. I can actually put you through if you, if you want. <laughs> I don't see myself doing it though. Don't worry, you like it. <laughs> you like it. Oh well, um, let me take you to a more befitting place so we can sit, relax, and enjoy ourselves. Take alcohol. Hmm. Baby soup. Yeah. Uh, chicken hey. baby soup or fish baby soup. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go. Sit back. Okay. I do not have anything to do with that man. Don't lie to me. I saw you. I saw you with him. Don't lie. Oh. If you lie to me, you you collect. You collect, oh. I will collect. You collect. Ugo, you will slap me? For what now? What did I do? Are you my husband? And why are you going about stalking me? Why would I, why would I go about... I didn't even put this... I don't know what you said, whatever you said. Why would I do it? Huh? When you, you, you are busy sleeping with another man, why would I do it? Ugo, me, sleep with another man? Where? At a joint? My God, Ugo, you're just being unreasonable. How will I not be unreasonable? You, do you think I'm still thinking well? 
How will I reason well when I, I, I'm seeing you going from one man to another? Why? How do you want me to function? You know how much I love you. Why, why, why will you be treating me that way? Is it because he has a car? Or where? Because he has a car and me, I don't, hold, uh, I don't have a car. No problem. Don't worry. It's okay. You can go ahead and uh, be moving around with him. I swear, the next time I see you with that man, right in front of him, I'll beat you up and I'll break his car. Don't worry. So if he finally marries me, what will happen? How else do you want to help me? How else do you want to help me other than the one you're already helping? Are you talking to me? Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? What do you mean what am I talking about? You will soon know what I'm talking about. How else do you want to help me other than sleeping with my girlfriend? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by what do I mean by that? You are sleeping with my girlfriend. That's what I'm here to, to tell you. And I know. I know. Hey, who are you? Who are you talking to? You. You're talking to me? Yes. Hey, do you know who I am? Huh? Do you know who I am? You come to my side and be saying jargons. Who's your girlfriend? Okay, you will not know now. You will not know because you have many. You touch this one, you touch... Okay, stay away from my girlfriend. Else you will see a side of me you've never seen all your life. Who That's why I'm here to tell you. Yeah, yeah, listen, you listen to me. You're nothing but a local man, hmm? okay? Probably you're one of those beggars okay. that is coming here to say nonsense. Okay. Yakubu, mm. do you know this man? Now listen, okay. I want you to leave this place this minute before I do something to you that you won't like. I am not going anywhere. I came here to tell you to leave my girlfriend else. The next time I come here, I will bring, you see this thing you call a house? I'll bring it down. You bring what down? Yes. You bring my mansion I down. I said I will demolish it. You can't do such a thing. Who the hell are you? Touch my girl again. You can't do so My friend, leave here before I, before I crush you. I said, leave here. Touch my girl again now. Who is your girlfriend if I may ask? You won't know now. Yakubu. Yakubu. Man, who is smart out of this place? Yeah, who, who is this yeah, person? Come, you're wasting time. Come. I said, leave you at the count of three. One, two, two, three. Yakubu, four. Come down. Yakubu, come down. With your hammer, come down with your chisel, everything. Come, come and destroy this. Who, who are you? Come, Yakubu. See what will happen to you. I say, leave. Leave this place and don't come back here. I'll leave. I'll leave, but I'll still come back. And there's nothing you can do about it because you love me. Me and you were like this. You are who? Me and you. See, I've warned that your boyfriend, though. I gave him very serious warning. If he likes, let him have sense. If he doesn't like, let him not have sense. That's his business. I will teach him sense. Story. My friend, go away. I'll come back. Get out. Go away. No, Don't I'll you come ever back. come back here again in your life. One hour, I'll come Useless back. Useless human being. Useless man. I'll be back in one hour. Go away. 30 minutes, I'll be back. Try me. Come back this house again. What is wrong with you? Okay. Mama, is, 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 is he about to go? Just imagine. What happened? Just imagine Ugo went to Johnson's site to warn him. What? With Johnson? My destiny helper? Uh -uh. Mama, which one is destiny helper? I'm talking about the man that came to the Akara joint. Oh, it's only a destiny helper that can give you that kind of money. Yotago? So that is why I call him Destiny Helper. He's taking too much for granted and I don't like it. No, Mama, don't worry. I have already talked to him. Me, I have dealt with him my own way. Nkab, your own way. I will personally deal with him my own way. Mama? Yeah, take care of the house. Mama, where are you going? Mama! Mamu go. Eh? Because what I want to do is to go. Why you go? 
I bet you go no go no no no. Ah, you can't see what's So you're asking God no no. We go is not tired. We do. We go is not. We shop. I'm actually on my. So come on, what am I walking to go? Why is it? Eh? I was actually on my way to your house. And what I go is not. Everything is not okay. What have I done to go now? Eh? Oh man, look, listen. You know, go. You know that young man, eh, eh, Johnson, eh? That that comes around to see my daughter. Who go saw him with my daughter and went to his office to harass him? On oh, harass there for what? Oh, but could you see one? Is he married to my daughter? Um, no, Biko, just calm down. No, if I eh? were called, he's just putting uh, 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 um, um, sand inside my gary. Can you not say something far? It will anyway. Calm down. I will talk to my son. Like I told you earlier on, he is not at home now. When he comes back. I will talk to him. Because, Thank God that we met here now. We could talk to him. Maka, what I had planned to do to him, I mean, believe now, I got to an hour. Yes, yes, even at this age. You understand? Even when he been, you know how it is. I mean, look at this, your lovely daughter. Eh? You will not want someone to come and nearly uh, spoke on a bicycle now. Eh? Because Jim Chukwa, you Talk to him, oh. Eh? I will talk to him. Eh? Mama, we are sorry. We are sorry. Come, Bali, Jeben, and see you. Okay, Mama. Who will not allow me to eat and keep blood on the ground. Every time I so so problem, if I keep money, he will steal. As old as he is. Amaka, please now. Please now. I've been begging you for at least about 30 minutes now. Please now. Please. I told you to stop begging me. He's not going to change anything. Stop begging me. It's not true. It's not true. You don't have a heart of stone. I know you. You're my loving younger sister now. And you're close to Chinya. If you talk to Chinya, she, she will listen to you. Please now, tell her I'm sorry. Oh? I will talk to her. Hey. Hey, thank you. Thank you. No, don't be too excited, though. I will talk to her on one condition. Condition? Mm-hmm. Which condition again? I will talk to her if you promise to let Mr. Johnson be. Hey, 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 hey. Don't mention that idiot name here. Because he's, he's trying to... He's trying to do what, Produko? He's not trying to do anything. He's just trying to help Chinere and her family. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. If you continue doing like this, eh? Produko, I'll not be telling you anything again. Yeah. But... Well, you said he invited her over now. Of course, they invited her over. And you said you saw them at Mama Keshi's uh, chicken, uh, whatever, chicken point. <laughs> but you go. I only asked you to just go there. Bosh, observe, not go there to make issue with anybody. He even went as far as confronting him. What, what if saying? he arrests you and charge you? What are you saying? Eh? How can I go there and see something like that? A man playing with my wife and I will not talk. Why, why are you talking like this? So you should take part of the blame. It's also your fault. No problem, but I will still not be telling you anything if you keep doing this. I will not. Oh, yeah, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I overreacted. Sorry. I'll say my own. Don't stop making trouble. I will only listen to you if you, you apologize to that man. Apologize for what? Oh, you don't know. Fine, I will tell you. Until you apologize to an innocent man who did nothing, yet you accused him. Only then will I listen to you. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. What mm. are you doing like this? Calm down. Yeah, this is the way you are shouting. You want people to be laughing at me. Relax now. Apologize. What the fuck? Always making things hard for me. Why? Why will I not be hard on you when you're trying to take out bread from my mouth and place it with stone? Is taking... That guy is a visitor. Does he sell bread to you? I don't even understand. You're there shouting, right? Continue shouting. When you're ready to do business, let me know. Which one is business again? Oh. Are you now selling the thing? Here. Yeah. Are you going to apologize to him or not? Yeah, see. Mama, 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 Mama,
Exactly, Mom. Mama, Mr. Johnson called me on phone mm -hmm. and told me that my name came out as one of those who won. I didn't believe it. So I decided to go to the office where I did it to check. Mama, on getting there, they confirmed that my raffle ticket won me a visa, <laughs> residency, <laughs> and, <laughs> and five years old <laughs> service in America. <laughs> Is it a dream? Are you serious? Mama, I am more than serious! <laughs> What is it? I'm asking you. What is it? Did I sleep with your girlfriend again? Huh? I'm sorry I overreacted. Oh, you're sorry? You overreacted? Well, I am not surprised. After all, that is how illiterates like you behave. Why are you insulting me? Huh? Why are you insulting me? I'm here to apologize to you. If you don't want to take my apology, let me go. I'll take it back and go. Are you serious? You will take your apology back. You see, my problem with some of these poor men is that they are proud and arrogant. You're here to apologize, and you're telling me you will take back your apology if I don't want to accept it. Huh? You don't have money yet, you're this proud. What if eventually you have everything on earth? How will you behave? Ross, I'm here to apologize to you. I'm sorry. Have you forgiven me? I don't have a problem with you. And next time, don't stop me on my way again, else I will crush you. Chinyere, yeah. I'll be going back. My mother will be expecting me. It's okay, no that problem. That one we'll see later. <laughs> Thank you. So I'll see you later. Okay. Congratulations for. Huh? I don't understand. I heard her saying congratulations. What's she congratulating you? <laughs> Amaka told me that you went to apologize to Johnson. Why are you frowning? Why won't I frown? It was a very, very stupid move in, in the first place. Something I shouldn't have done. Why are you complaining because you did the right thing? Which right thing? Right thing that reduced me and got me insulted. Eh? Plenty insult, though. How do you mean? Idiot insulted me now. Talking to me as if I'm, 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 I'm nobody. Just because I decided to do something that I shouldn't have even done in the first place because I, I, I didn't wrong him in any way. The way you're feeling right now, it's exactly the same way he felt. So, you need to understand. Understand what? Why is it always like this? Eh? Why should I be the one to chew the bitter pill all the time? Why? Why should I swallow the bitter pill all the time? When it happens to me, I have to understand. It happens to another person, I still have to understand. Why? Ugo, please just let it go. Please. Why should I let it go? Wait, wait. Did you... Did you just call me Ugo? No. I'm no longer baby. Ha! Oh. Why are you complaining about virtually everything? Why will I not complain when you, 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 you I, I don't I don't have any I don't mean anything to you anymore. My love, you've given it to that idiot. Huh? You have replaced me with him. Why why wouldn't I complain? Eh? If it's before you call me baby. Baby, my love, baby. Now is you go. Why won't I complain? You know the truth. And you can tell yourself the truth if you want to. 
you are one of the reasons I stayed back in this village after my youth service. And that's because I wanted to spend ample time with you. Anybody who comes to this village and sees that I'm a graduate and I'm not using my certificate just feels that I'm whiling or wasting away my time. It really hurts me when you say things like this to me because it just makes me feel like that decision I took was me being a fool. Well, it's okay. Thank you. And Hey, but my daughter, how would we get 500 thousand naira now? Eh? Now this is a real opportunity that I won't allow it to slip out of our hands. Papa, don't worry yourself. I will forfeit it. I mean, we don't even have the money. You say forfeit? You will forfeit what? Forfeit. Akos Kwanudialka. This is a rare opportunity and there's no way we would let it slip by. So I could go and come for feet. For feet, Guinea. Mama, what will we do? Uh, let me ask. Eh? Suppose we had this money and you traveled. Are there benefits attached? Or is it just for sightseeing? Sightseeing, Kwa Papa? No. I have a work permit. If I go there, even if it's two, three years, with a good job. I'll be able to make money that will change our lives. Are you serious? Yes, Papa. Then we will not miss this opportunity. Money will come out. I am sure money will come out. Eh? I, how I wish my Akara business would pay for this. Eh? Mama, don't worry. That business has tried. It saw me through school up to university level. I know money will come. Money will come. Is there a tree you planted somewhere that we can go and pluck money from? Hi! Udi Akanga say I wish I had a, a good son-in-law. Mama, please, don't go there. Why won't she go there? Is she not saying the truth? Eh? How can you not have a man that will rise to the occasion? It's not a man. Eh? Which man? Is it everybody in Nangaragana as a man? They go. So, Amadi, if you could help, so that my daughter will not miss this golden opportunity of going to abroad, I will be so excited. I don't mind to pay you hmm, and put the uh, uh, on top of it. If you, I have nobody to go to, that's why I said let me come to you first. Eh? And, and I'm very sure that um, you will do it for me. Um, um, mm. um, um. Of course, you don't like no more job, but you My dear friend, look at it. Well, um, you are not the kind of person I will refuse or hide anything from. As well. mm. To be honest, mm, I don't have that kind of money. I don't even realize up to a hundred thousand naira in my shop for a whole week anymore. Hmm? So, what can come by the good, eh? Who cares? Yeah. Uh, uh, yes, um, uh, yeah, I've heard you. Mm -hmm. eh? I know you cannot lie to me. Uh, so, <laughs> Adria, I will look for someone else. It's okay. You know? well, I'm very mm -hmm. sorry, my friend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Okay, so my brother. Ah. How I wish I had this money. Nothing would have stopped me from giving it to you. Look, this is one opportunity Junior should not miss for anything in this life. Anything. Hey. Jamaisa. Nah. nah. I've been to the end of the world. Yet I've not been able to raise even a penny. Everybody that I meet do have beautiful stories to say 
about this golden opportunity. But not one person is ready to help. For them. Uh, my brother, I wouldn't want you to see it in that light. Yes, after all, these are uh, people who benefited from you, you know, when the going was good. So many of them benefited from you. Yeah? I think uh, it, it has to be blamed on the times we are in. The times are hard. Everybody knows that. Times are hard. Money itself is hard to come by. You see? So I wouldn't want you to blame it on that. But uh, let us still uh, hope that uh, something must uh, break. Somehow, I, I think I'm hopeful. Eh? Jamanze. Enna. Jamanze. Ndimmelo gamalo zimcha. Hey. Ogome no time. It is no time. Hmm? Don't worry. Okay? Let us still see. Can you go down here? Wait, man. Keep us in there. I'm sick and cast in a pata. Come by, Zuko Dike. Eh? If, if there is any way I can assist, eh? maybe something might come in, I will let you know. Oh. Eh? Okay, so please. Oh. Huh? Oh. I don't understand. What are you trying to say? Baby, I want you to talk to your brother for me. Eh? <laughs> Just rewind what you have just said. See, Obi, your brother has abandoned me for Chinyere. Please, tell him that I love him more than Chinyere. Hey. Hmm? Why? 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 See here. The next time you see me, don't ever try this nonsense again. Pop, 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 pop. Obi? 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 It's Vicky, Obi. Vicky. Vicky, nice. What is happening? Obi, too? Obi. See, Osondo. I know things have been rough between us for some time. Things are about to change. Believe me, if you lend me this money, I will not only pay you back in due time, but it will also fix our friendship. Yes. Ugo, you are very stupid. Oh, yes. Who says I'm interested in the return of our friendship? Now, listen. You collected the only girl I love and you are here standing and telling me about the return of our friendship. Who cares? Like a Jimmy is your now. But seriously, what, what happened between us? Yeah, we used to be very good friends, very, very good friends back in the days. What, yeah, what, what changed? Oh, yes. Everything changed the day you hypnotized Chinyere into preferring you over me. Oh, oh, okay, fine. I, I accept I messed up. Uh, well, I can still fix it. Between you and I. I don't really like Chine that much. Yes. I can talk to her and she will just become yours automatically. Believe me, you don't have to stress yourself. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> you can do all that for me. Of course. No. Are you not my guy? Just give me 500k. That's all. I will leave Chinya here for you. I'll just keep her like this. Talk to her. Tell her why she should be yours. I'll tell her I'm not good enough for her. You are the man. She'll follow you. 500k. <laughs> Go. Uh -huh. Am I here? You are one of the fools I've ever seen in my life. You are here standing. Telling me about the return of our friendship. I, even, I should even lend you money. As your bank account or at Awozin. Remember. Laid visual in my shop. It's not paid me. I don't want to ask you about that. Better come and pay me my money. Yes. 
So you are going to stay there for five years? Yes, five years. Mm -hmm. You are lucky. <laughs> yes. I don't have all that, but I'll try. You know, my betting center hasn't been here in much lately. So, my business is shaking somehow. Yes. How come? How do you mean? Is it not since they opened that church? Mommy Gio's new church. Exactly. <laughs> how, how did you know? Uh -uh. It's just around your betting center. Oh man, since they opened that church, baby, they've preached away all my customers. How? They said, if you bet, you will go to hellfire. So all my customers, they are just scared. They don't want to go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> so how have you been coping? Mm, I'm managing. I still have some customers that are ready to go to hellfire. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Oh my God. Mm, um, babe, uh, I will give you 100,000. Yes, I know it's not much, but at least manage it. Ah, you know? Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. See, I'm making you a promise. Once I get there, the very first money I'll make, I will refund the money. Yeah? Refund? Go and say to him first. I'm not talking about you refunding the money. I love my, my girl. I'm not your girl or son, but thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> No problem. Let me bring it for you. Yeah. Hey, thank you. Hey, Father Lord, I thank you. Hey. Why are you looking gloomy? I'm not looking gloomy, I'm just... And you're not even inside, you are all outside by yourself. I've told you not to worry. Eh? Forget about this, there must be a way out. Eh? It's just unfortunate that all these things are happening now that I don't have money. Eh? I went to go, from there I went to Okaji, and three other people, all they were giving me a bundle of excuses. And these are human beings that, when they come to me for financial assistance, I will assist you without hesitating. But they are, look at them. And their care of business is not even doing well. Like he used to. I don't know. What, what do we do? What, what do you think we should do? What do we do? Honestly, I have been thinking about a way out. Eh? But that is, uh, it's, as it is now, uh, it's, just, it's, it's like we have only one option. We have an option. W what option? Any one option. You know, this is the only piece of land that we have. And this is one opportunity we will not let go in kitchen. This thing will make us go far. We will strive and get better in this. It will benefit the whole family. I'm a guamie in the mail. Papa, but this is a huge gamble. It's as if it's a do or die thing. We could have looked for any other means of making money or raising the money without having to relinquish the only property we have. Junior, I don't like the way you and your mother are making me feel. You people are making me feel as if I have done the most unreasonable thing in here on the earth. Ah, Papa, of course not. It's very far from that. It's just that I'm under so much pressure. What you have done for me, I have to do a lot to make this family proud. You have sacrificed so much for me. Junior. Papa. You are not going to fail. I'm a man name. Huh? You are my mother's namesake. The one that I love so much. 
you are educated and very smart. I trust you. I, I, I know what you are capable of doing. You will go to Budoiba and come back with good news. Trust me. Thank you, you don't so mind the way that is telling you is the only hope. You are my only hope and I know when you come back, the story will change. Thank you, Papa. I trust you. It's okay, Mom. Which is blessed in Niger. Thank you, Papa. Now listen very carefully. When you get to Budo, you go. Know where to go and where not to go. Obey the law is their second name. They are not like here in Nigeria where, where they say don't go. You see the person yes, on a, on a like What is your problem? Don't you know that I, I, I am a civil servant? So what? What only got skid your last? And then what happened? Uh -huh. Somebody who got to the level of level 8 and then before my salary to be level 6. I know my not 6. Stop lying to your children. Oh, my in the rack, I am not level 6. Because I know now. I know my lack, but I'm educated. Level 6. Manuka, how much you pay before you could get that level 6? How much I paid before I got the level 6? If not for one thing, I would have still been in the civil service. Okay. Good day, Mama. Bye bye. Eh, Where is Ugo? He's at the backyard. Okay, thank you. Um, is everything all right? Mama, everything is okay. I'm coming. Go the way. What is this madness all about? Eh? Chinyere's love affair with my son is unbecoming. It's Mama. becoming something else. Mama, just let them be. Okay, just let them be. They love themselves. Love for what? Ha. I am only pitying Chinyere. I am only pitying her. You know your brother. <laughs> what I call him. Unless she's ready to suffer. I'm traveling, I'm finally traveling. My father got the money. Are you serious? Yes! He did! <laughs> good. <laughs> what is it? You're not happy for me? Of course I'm happy. I'm happy just that I'm not happy with myself. I wasn't even able to contribute a dime. I couldn't put in. Don't worry. I understand. Hmm? Don't worry. It's okay. Don't understand. Yeah, how will your father be seeing me now? He, in his mind, he feel I'm just one useless boy. That, like, in fact, if you see me like a failure, I, I can't even contribute. What even? Even if it's five hundred naira. Uh, my father is not like that. He's not even thinking in that direction at all. Leave that thing. Yes? Stop covering up. You know what I'm talking about. I'm not happy. I'm not doing well. I'm not doing well. Why are you always like this? Why do you always like to pull the pity card? I'm not pulling any pity card. It's the truth. Yeah, it's the truth. I can't even contribute. You're traveling. Not even. I'm not doing well. I'm not happy. I'm not pulling any pity card. I'm not happy. Coco, mm -hmm. I came here very excited to share this news with you. Now see how you're ruining the moment. Okay. It's fine. I'm not complaining. In addition to that one, you, you, how will I even cope? Eh, only me in this village. You now travel and stay there for five years. Five. It's just five years. How can so... you say five years is just five years? 365 days times five. Ah. Not just to. Hey. Not just. Yeah? Only me in this village. Go before you know it, I'm back. It's not like that, though. Before I know it, uh, you'll be back. I already know it. And you've not even gone. I know it. It won't be easy for me. Besides, you now go to that place. All those uh, people are abroad. All those Igbo people, they always have money. Things are always good for them. Me, I don't have money. Next thing now, different men will start <laughs> carrying, you, <laughs> carrying you up and down. How will I cope? That's your problem. This was not our argument now. Eh? We had this plan that... Anything we are, you know, uh, arranging for our future, it will be for both of us. We'll be planning together. Now, this particular plan, I'm not even in, in the picture. Okay. I, I, okay, I, see, I think you my, know. My BP is rising. Okay, now. 
the good opportunity. Don't start now. I can't miss this opportunity. Hmm? I need to check my blood pressure. I'm not, I'm not yes. to sister, we're going to miss you. <laughs> Me too. Um, sister, how long will it take you to settle in? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm still here. Wait. Why did you ask? Uh, because I know that when you get over there, you start making so much money. Hmm? At least you'll be sending while I'll be helping you to be keeping the money. Because we need to start building a new house here. I'm tired of staying this glorified at home. <laughs> hey, Michael. See, it's fine. I'm making adequate plans for that. Okay? Sister, people travel overseas and send money to people they think love them and they can trust. Only to come back and cry. Sister, please don't let this before also. For the first time, I'm trusting you. Listen, I have everything under control. All right? Nothing of sort will happen. Trust you, sister. <laughs> Why are you taking my handshake? <laughs> For the first time, I'm trusting you. <laughs> I'm trusting you. <laughs> Um, I want to go to Mama Keche's house. Eh? After sweeping, you go and warm the soup. Okay. Mm? I'll be right back. Amaka said her mother fell and I don't know, maybe the the fall affected her brain or something. She can't recognize anybody anymore. It's just been like this. Talk. This is serious, sir. That means you need to take her to hospital as soon as possible. Ah, with which money? Where's the money now? If I had money, would my mother still be here? I do have. I'll give you a hundred thousand now. Ah, come on now. That's a bruise on my ego. Besides, now that you're traveling, you need all the money you can get. See, my father sold our only piece of land. So there's money. And then a kind friend of mine gave me a hundred thousand naira. That's the one I want to give to you. Hmm? Thank Please. You. Thank you, man. Thank you. But who is this kind friend of yours? Yes, I... I want to meet him. Huh? Hmm. You know, all kind of people are criminal minded fellows. They can be very funny. Okay, uh, Papa. Put it this way. Okay. Uh, uh, it's in your ego, though. Just mm. be mindful. Be mindful mm. of it. Yes, Papa. Papa is okay. Mm. It's, it's covered. Okay. If anybody comes towards this direction, tell the person you're okay. Papa, you're okay. Hello. 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 Good morning, Papa. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, how is your mother? Hey. Mother, my health is getting worse by the day. Yeah. Oh, uh, so what is the hospital saying is wrong with her? They have not said anything. You can't lay their finger on what's, what exactly is wrong with my mother. She's just there. Huh? <laughs> Nothing. They're still saying they can't find anything. It's very ill. Huh? This is a failed system. The doctor did what the problem is. I don't know what's going on. Yes. I, don't I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's just getting worse. 
Yes. Yes. You have to be going now, so you don't miss. Oh, okay. Yes, sister. Yes. by the side. Please go straight, go, go don't stop her by the, the junction. In a see go for the In a Kenya, you know, talk about. Brother, you've been like this all day. Are you okay? I'm not okay. I'm not okay at all. At all, at all. Thoughts, too many things, too many things. I... Mama's health is getting worse by the day. Huh? I mean, I'm just thinking, if Mama dies now, where, where will I get money to bury her? Brother, nobody is dying. God forbid, but Mama cannot die. What do you want me to say? Eh? I'm a man now. I'm a, the first child. I have to be thinking of, you know, things like this. I have to think ahead. Where will I get money from? The, the, the last money we had was the 100,000 that gave to me before she traveled. I used everything to pay for Mama's drugs. Now I don't have a dime anymore. Eh? Honestly, I don't know why this thing is happening to us. I don't know. Hey, brother, speaking of Chinyere, what last did you hear from her? She called me last week. She said she's still trying to settle down there. You know, she said she doesn't have money. Me, I don't believe her. I believe she has money she doesn't want to send to me. Ah, brother, it's barely three months she traveled. <laughs> where do you expect her to get the money from? There. There, abroad, where she is. <laughs> There's a lot of money there. You think you think it's like this place where we're always suffering? Don't you watch TV? Don't you see the people uh, over there, the way they look? Eh? It's not like here that we'll just be killing ourselves from one problem to the other. People abroad, they are living very well. Really? Yes. Ha. Things are different there. Things are rosy. The economy there is moving. Everything is moving. I, I know. Once you get to that place, assuming you arrive on Sunday, eh? before the next Sunday, you are a millionaire. <laughs> Brother, you sometimes you are missing me. Okay, no problem. I've heard you. Hmm. Let me go and um, bring your food for you. Can't I sit down in my uncle's house again? Eh? I hope you do not come here to call to, to ask, me, ask me of money. Because I'm gonna make a go. Hey. I have no money. What is going on now? What's going on? Since my father died, you took everything that belonged to my father. He didn't give me anything. Even the plot of land that my father left for me, you also took it. Is it wrong for me to come now and ask you for that land? Who got you? Hmm? What did you say? You heard me. The piece of land that my father left for me, give it to me. I want it. That's why I'm here. Okay, go and take it. What are you saying? Go and operate it. I, 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 need, I need the land, the piece of land that my father left for me before he died. Go, Joe, where Okay, why are you sounding like this? Let's sit down, discuss, know how we are going to do it. So I'll, I'll get the land. Which one is this thing you are doing now? Are you not ashamed of yourself? Oh. You get the mind to walk into my compound and ask me of the land that I saw three years ago. Excuse me. Are you are you okay? Excuse me. 
No way, Toto. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. It's not possible now. That was not the agreement. Okay. So what? Okay. Was that the agreement? You told me that my, my father took loan from you. And that was why you took the land. So the plan is, once I get the money, pay you back, I get my land. What, what do you mean you sold it? And you take all the years before you come and pay me. In fact, I get problem and I use the money to do something. How is it my business if you have a problem? Was that the agreement? No. Okay, now I know. Now I know because before my father died, he was very, very sick. My father was very ill. He was dying. We kept on begging you to give us this uh, the, the land so that we can sell it and get money. You said no. That my father is owing you money. Fine, my father now died. We sat down, me, you, and some elders. The agreement was, once I go and find the money, three million, and I give to you, I get back my land. So what are you saying? Give me my land, please. Ugojuku, the land have been already sold. 